Hello, collective, wherever you are. I hope you're somewhere safe, somewhere warm, surrounded by love, light, happiness, joy, abundance, and filled with so much faith. Real quick, can you do me a favor? Can you hit that like button? Please hit share if you like to share. And hit subscribe and turn that notification bell on to all so you can always be updated whenever I put another message out there for you guys. And if you'd like to donate, you do not have to. It's not a requirement, but it is truly appreciated. The information is in the description box down below. And thank you from the bottom of, but with all of my heart, ahead of time to anybody and everybody who chooses to do so. And um, to everybody who has been, thank you, thank you, thank you. May God bless your beautiful souls tenfold. All right, guys. <clears throat> so, let's see what's going on here. Um, Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels. Ooh, we have the Nine of Swords and the Four of Swords. I mean, the Four of Cups, I'm sorry. Yeah, so somebody is, like, up all night boohoo crying um, over you, which I'm really getting. They realize you were their gift um, from God and like they they're, they're missing out on you and you're like what you got going on they realize you were their blessing and um they treated you like shit and they realize now it's completely over um they're definitely heartbroken mm-hmm okay whatever 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 they should treat you you know what i mean they should treat you correctly treat you right yeah, we have the four swords and the look we have four four um four swords and the four of cups here. Yeah, they're praying for you. They're praying that you you know, you'll take them back. Guys, please, please, you know, you know I'm always saying do not, you know, take you know, if you cut anybody you cut off, keep them keep them in the past okay um you know god had you get rid of them god exposed them to you for a reason he had you cut them people off for a reason okay um they're they're trying to heal or they're praying for you to come back to them um and they're trying to heal from this they, yeah because they see you're the empress all right they see that you're like you're all the queens embodied in one um you know they you're you're very creative you're very fertile um, you know, you're, you're a very loving, nurturing, caring, beautiful, divine being, all right? Beautiful, 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 whether you're masculine or feminine. Yeah. Four swords. Well, there's a lot of, uh, like, praying and healing here. Say pray to Holy Spirit, divine spirit, angels, ancestors, and loved ones that passed away. What does the, oh, Lord, thank you. Yeah, mm-hmm. Like everything I said so far is a source truth, right? And the one million percent a source truth about these motherfuckers right here, you see, smiling in your face, stabbing you in the back has come out. Ooh, they've been what being watched. Okay. So what I'm getting from this is your past person I strongly feel it's either your past person, confirmation, and or um people like that you've cut off, right? It's come to their um they finally went inwards. They realize now that, you know, um they were the problem that, you know, they, they're they smiling in your face, tapping in the back, they shouldn't, they, they fumbled the ball when it came to you, all right, they realized you were their blessing, they knew this deep inside, they're extremely heartbroken um, about this, they, also, these people um, have been being watched, okay, by, like, the authorities, the authority figures, um, and the one million percent ace towards truth about these people, and something to do with a home, something with a house, it could be, um, and I'm strongly feeling there's like cameras in a house or something, or they're like stalking you, um, stalk like this. I'm definitely gang stalking. Something about gang stalking, um, and about these people smiling in your face, stabbing you in the back. But the authorities, um, like have been watching them and they know everything. They know the truth about all this, and they're scared to death. They also know that they're being watched. Sorry, um, and somebody could definitely have black, black hair, like longer, like a gentleman with longer, like you know, shoulder length black hair. Um, this could be you or this could be somebody involved in this situation. But they're going inward, okay? They're this, um, they're going inward, they're starting to come to realization like they were the problem. That they, you know, they're finally, you know, coming true to themselves and realizing what's going on. They're, they're praying you know, um, that you'll forgive them one day. They might want to come in with some truth and clarity to you, um, only because they know that, like, about them smiling in your face, stabbing you in the back. I feel like somebody wants to tell you, give you some information about, um, other people that were doing this to you too, and what, maybe why they did this. I feel like they were getting paid to do this. Um, 
I feel like they're trying to save their own answer possibly or maybe they it might even be you know it might even be authentic because maybe they, they feel like if they're finally honest with you for once that you'll forgive them um because they know you know like it's just dumb it don't make any sense it just you know of course like why would you ever let anybody back in your life that like you know has done you so dirty like i would say keep these people in the past guys please don't let them come in and fuck you over again but also um well hold on let me see what else comes out before i say that but yeah oh ten of swords then they know yeah painful permanent ending i feel like somebody might actually uh, be getting locked up for a unaliving or planning to unalive you it's a painful permanent ending to somebody holding on to you or holding on to something that belongs to you everything's being balanced out you are heavily protected because you're a whole fucking earth angel out in this bitch you're gonna get some sort of message like I said somebody wants to come forward with some sort of information to you but I feel like they feel stuck. They feel stagnant. They don't know how to come forward with this message, like, to you, this information to you. Because, like, I feel, I strongly feel like you have them blocked. Um, and I strongly feel like you should keep it that way. But, um, yeah. Mm-hmm. But I'm also strongly getting somebody what's being watched, um, somebody, like, they're, they, there's some sort of tr one million percent truth and clarity coming out about either an attempt to unalive you or, um, actually unaliving somebody. Yeah. Holy Spirit. I just heard the name Sean. Sean could be, that could be your name. Um, it could be someone's first name, middle name, last name, or it could be somebody involved in this situation. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. The Hierophant. Yeah, this, who, this whole group, cult, coven, secret society, whatever this is. Yeah, they're trying to block you. Um, they're being watched. All right. They're trying to block you. Um, they're trying to block you. They're trying to like, you know, they're trying to do a lot of fucked up shit to you. But they're being watched, okay? The 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 police know about this whole group, cult, secret society. Somebody could have, wear glasses. Somebody could um, have brown hair. Have and Somebody could have a beard. Um i feel like they're studying you or like they're they i don't know somehow i feel like there's somebody in the justice system that they have a um they have a connection with somebody in the justice system and they got like your records or something they got like you know if you've ever been like your your past like they know your whole rap sheet all right and this is like they're trying to study it and trying to figure out like they they're this is like some like really like you know it's like a fucking cult or something or or some shit um secret society that has a lot of like they have a lot of um resources you know what i mean they pay a lot of people off and shit but i feel like they're be very careful because they're trying to block you and i feel like they're going through like your your rap sheet or whatever and like even your families and everything they're trying to find um they're like studying you they're trying to find a way to knock you down maybe like you know see if you have any old childhood wounds that you haven't healed yet and their, their plan is to um somehow open that wound because they're trying to lower your vibration so that they can send some sort of attack to you but it's not going to happen it's not going to happen it's not going to work all right you are way too healed you've been you know you healed way too much first of all you're way too protected let's just throw that one out there you're way too protected your vibration's way too high um but they are just be aware and be mindful of this all right but like you know it's not going to affect you so don't worry um you know, the one million percent is sort of truth has come out about this. And I'm strongly getting that this person that was in the law enforcement that they had on their side is, you know, they either got fired or they're going to get fired or they're going to they're turning. They're turning on um, this this group cult secret society, this coven or whatever. They're coming forward. They're trying to save their own ass and they're coming forward with all the information about this group cult secret society, this coven, this club, whatever this is. Yeah. Five of Pentacles. They're trying to have you put out and like, you know, they feel left out like with your success, you know, whatever you got going on. They're trying to have you put out. They're trying to block you and have you possibly like kicked out of a house or a home or something like that. Now, this is what they wanted for you. This is what's going to happen to them. And I'm strongly getting with the five pentacles too. Like this, this, whoever they have on the inside, the authority figures that they're paying off or whatever. I feel like they're, they're cutting these, they're cutting this, you know, them off and they're, you know, 
they're coming forward with, and there's something definitely here about a house, a home, something about a home, some illegal shit in a home. Maybe somebody got unalived in a home that's coming forward, like something about that, or like there's cameras in a house illegally watching and spying on you. Um, some shit like that. I don't fucking know. Something like that's happening here. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, ain't the devil, of course. The one million percent East Church truth has come out about this whole group called Coven Secret Society. Whatever these people are, um, you know, in this devilish, devilish energy. Um, yeah, the one million percent truth is coming out about that. They're obsessed with trying to do some, they're like doing some sort of like, I feel like they're trying to send you like something like to have you have a heart attack or something like that. Or like, but they, or they're putting something in your drink or your food to try to possibly um, have you have a heart attack or something like that. It's not going to happen. All right, it's not going to happen. They're obsessed with stopping you and blocking you. But somebody's cutting off, somebody's releasing a devil. Um, it might be this authority figure. I don't fucking know. Or maybe it's somebody, like that person, that your ex or whoever, that realized I had this awakening that, you know, it, that they're, that they were the problem. And maybe they're the ones that are cutting this, you know, they're, they're cutting this, um, this devilish energy, these people in the secret society. It's definitely a cult, a coven, something like that, something like devil worshipers. They definitely worship the devil. Um, they, you know, it's a dark practice, whatever this is. But you're a spiritual leader, you're extremely gifted, you're extremely um, intuitive, you're extremely powerful, all right? You're very wise, and they want to know how you have all this wisdom, this knowledge, this sacred wisdom, and sacred knowledge, and how you have this much strength and power. Um, because, what do you mean? Like, are you fucking kidding me? They don't understand how when they send all these attacks to you, you just keep growing. It doesn't affect you, it does the opposite. It's like the polar opposite of what they send out to you. Um, it's because like these people need to like get off their high horses and realize they're not attacking you. They're not attacking you. They're attacking themselves. Um, <laughs> cause they're like, well, why is collective just like, we just send like this death bell, this, you know, whatever to collective. And you know, it's not affecting them. They're just getting stronger, more powerful, more beautiful, more handsome, more, you know, um, and they're just more elevating. And how come our lives are coming to shit? People are turning on us and you know what I mean? Like we're turning on each other and this, that, and the other, and we're having like our doors kicked in, you know, feds are like not, you know what I mean? It's because it's not a it's not, it's not coming to you. You're too high now. You're in your purpose. Okay. Especially if you're in your purpose, nothing is going to fucking touch you. It's going to be stopped before it can even go out. It's going to be stopped. There's like a, you know, um, a huge fucking uh, sacred bubble of protection around you that it doesn't even get into your energy. All right, it's going, it's going to bounce right off to that fucking, that, that bubble of protection you have, the secret bubble of protection you have, and it's going to go right back to the, to everybody in that, that is sending it to you or anybody that was involved in this and their loved ones and their bloodline, because that's how karma works. That's how it works. And they're just attacking themselves. They're just really fucking dumb at this point. <laughs> fucking losers. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angel. Thank you. Ten of Wands and the Nine of Cups. Oh, wow. They're heavily burdened. All right, we have the Ten of Wands. They're heavily burdened about you getting your ultimate wish fulfillment. Um, and they're spying on you. The Secret Society, Colt Coven, they're spying on you. They're watching you. They're heavily burdened because they're watching you get this ultimate wish fulfillment. Now, this whole reading is going to be centered by and um, uh, uh, of, you know, all surrounded and centered um, by your ultimate wish fulfillment. You're getting ultimate wish fulfillment. And this has people heavily burdened. They're spying on you. They're watching you. But also, you know, with the Hermit card here and the Page of Swords, it's definitely... Um, you know, the feds or the CIA, ATF, um, or military intelligence, Some, somebody's, they're watching, they're watching this group Cold Coven. They're being watched, trying to unalive you, planning to unalive you, um, and everything else that they've been doing. There, I feel like there's somebody, there's something about a log cabin or like a house in the woods that they go to or a village or a lodge or something like that, that they go to like a meeting ground or church, like something what they call church or it's like, you know, or a clubhouse or something like that. It might be in the woods um, that's being, you know, they're, that's, that's uh, being surveillanced. Um, it's like where they go to have the little powwows. Um, it doesn't have to be, but like I, I'm strongly feeling for somebody it is. It's in like, it's in a wooded area um, or there could just be a body, like, you know, there could be like a field or something by it. All right. Or, or it's like a village, like a little vill, um, it's like a little lodge or something like that. 
um, some place that they go. There's some about Philadelphia I'm getting as well. I don't know if Philadelphia could be significant to you or it could be somebody involved. Maybe some, maybe that's where it is, is Philadelphia or maybe somebody is from Philadelphia or something happened in Philadelphia. Or somebody could even just be a Philadelphia Phillies fan or Eagles fan or um, a Flyers fan. There's something significant about Philadelphia though. Um, some about Philadelphia, I don't know, but somebody could have green eyes and somebody could have brown eyes. This could be you or this could be somebody involved. Somebody could have a goatee. Somebody could have like a dark goatee, like how he has. This could be, you know, indicators to use, you know what I mean? To, to who this is that's doing this to you. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. Angels, ancestors, and loved ones passed away. What does the collective... Ooh. Somebody's talking hella shit about you. We have the seven of pentacles here. Whatever you're investing in, they're, they're watching you. Like, whatever you're investing in, like, it flourished beautifully. They're trying to... They're spying on you. They're trying to block it. It's not going to work. Um, there is not. You know, and any time they try to attack you or... or cause any endings or anything towards whatever you're investing in it's not it's just going to help your investments even grow and flourish even more they're dumb um like say if you have a channel like a youtube channel or something um and they're doing some sort of spells or whatever to have you get less views um and less like um donations and stuff like that like it, it's they, it, like guy could possibly be thrown in an illusion to make them think that is working so like you might notice your views going down a little bit but don't worry like don't worry it's just to let you know one to let you know um and be aware of what's happening and but don't worry because god's not gonna allow it to happen it's just an, it's just a facade it's just an illusion um and also like you know um so that these idiots think that they're working so that they're they're busy working on something that's irrelevant because god's going to make sure if they're attacking that yeah it might look as though you're not getting that many views or anything but god's going to turn around and fucking he's going to flip it and now what it, because they attacked you it's going to it's whatever views you would have had whatever donations you would have had but they thought they paul they, they slow down it, you're going to get it back even like 10 times even more i'm um, strongly like three or 10 times even more uh, it's going to come out of nowhere so it's really stupid and they're all they're doing is they're blocking their own they're doing money blockages they're they're blocking their own path their own their own money so now they're gonna have like you know bills coming in out of nowhere someone's name could be bill billy um you know uh william willie uh williams can be someone's name or you know um but they're going to be getting bills coming in out of nowhere, um, fines, fees, and stuff like that. Uh, they're going to start losing money. People are going to rob them. Um, you know what I mean? They're going to get less customers and whatever they do in their line of work. You know, stuff like that's going to happen to them. And it's uh, it, so, guys, please don't get upset. Or even if you have, like, your own business and you're not having as many clients or, not, not, you know, customers or something like that, don't worry. It's only a facade, okay? It's only a facade. And it's actually, and it's only to let you know and have you be aware of what is going on all right and just but don't worry because you know it, it might look as though it's not working but don't but don't worry because you know god god don't make any mistakes you know and god always keeps his promises so like i feel like it's what's happening is it's just to let you know what's going on and have these idiots thinking that it's working right so that their their stupid simple minds will continue to keep trying to attack that area because god already has your back and you know god's providing for you you know what i mean so they'll, they're they're too busy wasting all their time and energy on something stupid like that and when you know instead of like trying to unalive you and everything else um so like you know what i mean if there is a waste of uh, time and energy for these people because you know and it's also to, to have you aware of what's going on and then out of nowhere is your shit's going to just boom like you know you're going to start getting mad customers mad clients mad mad views mad you know what i mean it's just going to come up out of nowhere and it's going to be because they were sending these attacks to you so you're going to get it back tenfold what they thought they were they were slowing you down no they were actually attacking you and and um which actually they're just helping you get more subscribers more views more more donations more you know what i mean uh more customers more clients more, you know what i mean um wow they're just <laughs> they're just dumb so you can thank the haters actually thank you haters thank you you're fucking losers thank you um you know what i mean so just like you know just like the other day when that weirdo was fucking um someone's name could be tina um 
this could be your name or somebody involved, but like when when there was th that devil worshiper that 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 was talking shit that, um about God and Jesus, so I blocked her and she went and like, but she'd be sharing all my fucking videos. It don't make no damn sense, um, but like she thinks it's funny. And she, it just shows her character, right? Um, and also not only that, you're just getting more me more subscribers. So thank you. <laughs> Thank you, weirdo. <laughs> you're just getting more people that are seeing me and are like, you're a fucking weirdo and they're just subscribing to my shit. So thank you for helping me, helping my, my channel grow. And speaking of that, guys, um, I just want to take a moment and thank you all. Thank you so much to all my subscribers, everybody liking, um, commenting, and subscribing. Um, we're almost at 5 five K. Um, that's my goal. So for right now, it's to 5K. Then my next goal is going to be 10, 10K. Yeah, we got 4 four point six one nine so thank you thank you thank you i absolutely love you guys would not be here um wouldn't be able to do this without you and without you know first and foremost god you know so thank you thank you i absolutely love you guys um and you all been hitting me up like crazy about you know um making shirts and like getting caught and stuff like that i'm going to be once i you know um once i'm able to to do more like i'm at a little bit of hard a spot right now so um, you know what I mean? I lost my, you know, my actual nine to five job. I'm looking at it as like a blessing though. It, it definitely is. I, they, they weren't paying me enough anyway. So once I can get like my finances in order, um, I'm going to be, I already have mint. I have a lot of plans that I'm going to be doing. So I'm going to have a lot of merchandise and stuff, uh, for you guys. Do you know what I mean? And I'm also going to be doing like giveaways and stuff like that. But I just need to, you know, once I get more like where, you know, more, more um where, where i have more finances to be able to do this i'm going to i'm definitely going to i'm going to be giving back you know anybody that knows me knows how much of a loving you know and how i love to you know help other people out and i love to you know um give back i'm definitely i'm big on that so that will be happening and also we'll be having things for sale but i just need to get you know what i mean once i once i'm able to i definitely will um it is definitely coming but thank you guys. I absolutely love you guys. You're like the best. I have like literally the best subscribers in the world. Um, thank you. I absolutely love you. Even the Karmics, you know, fuck it. You're all still, you know, whatever. Because even the Karmics keep coming back. Because like it is part of my mission too, to also help people go from the dark and find the light. And I know that like, you know, there are Karmic people that have been on here hating and shit like that. But then they, they hear what's going on and it, and it awakens them and it realizes and like, you know what I mean? I'm all for that, helping people go from the dark to the light, you know what I mean? I pray for, you know, I pray for the enemy all the time, like, that they find, they find God, they, they stop the evil ways, um, and they, you know, stop doing people dirty, so, you know, karmics are welcome here all, all day, but one thing I will not put up with is anybody bullying anybody, anybody threatening anybody, and I will not put up, definitely will not put up with anybody talking shit about God or Jesus or the angels um, and the ancestors, I will not, I will not allow that, I will block your ass, I will report your ass if you threaten anybody, um, you know what I mean, or if you bully anybody, I don't fuck with bullies at all, I never did and I never will, so, yeah. But thank you um, to all you beautiful, amazing souls. I absolutely love you guys so much. Somebody could be Irish. This could be you or somebody involved in this situation could be Irish. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, and Loved Ones have passed away. What does the collective need to know? Thank you. boom the magician they're definitely doing some death magic okay they're doing like i said they're trying to do something with your heart they're trying to get your heart but it's not going to work um it's going back to them somebody could have like a bald head see how he's bald um someone's name could be don or donald because i'm looking at this thump thump and it's like making me think i don't know why i'm like thinking of trump like donald trump you know I'm not saying i'm that's this isn't about donald trump but i'm just saying like it could be like the his first name's donald you know what i mean so somebody someone's name could be don donald donnie but um somebody's running out of time and it says 110 on the clock so 110 could be significant but you're manifesting your new beginnings all right they're um they're doing some death, you know, death magic. They're doing some black magic. They're doing a lot of weird shit to you, but it's not affecting you. They were being watched, you know, doing this to you. They're sending you some sort of chaos magic too. It's not working. It's not working at all. Eight of cups. Yeah, these people that you walked away from. They're trying to get you. That's another thing, guys. It's just, it's very important um, 
that you just continue to keep showing up and keep going because it's go everything's going to pay off even if you don't see um any benefit of it now keep showing up it's you're manifesting your new beginnings you're manifesting this it's investing trust me even if you don't see it right now um and just be thankful for i'm not saying you're not but i'm just saying you know for especially for people that are just starting or just waking up and they're just starting their getting into their purpose um you know you might feel like you know because they're doing magic to make you try to walk away from your purpose just to get you to stop all right so you might you might feel like oh man this isn't panning out i'm not where where i figured i would be right now don't think like that okay instead to help this manifestation come even quicker and and more abundantly what you do is you be so grateful like y'all i'll be excited as fuck when i see like one like you know what i mean um you know, um, one new subscriber and everything, like, be so grateful and thankful for that, um, you know, when, when I, even when I get, like, a, a dollar, you know, a dollar and 11 cents, like, you know what I mean, donation, I get so pumped up, I get so excited, um, and it's, and so grateful, you know what I mean, so, and that helps, like, you keep coming in, like, that gratitude and appreciation, like, um, like, oh, and guys, with Cash App, y'all let me know, like, when y'all, when y'all donate to me on Cash App, um, I don't know if I can respond to you, the only thing that I know of is, like, to do the emoji thing, I asked my daughter if there's a way, she said that she doesn't think there is, she thinks it's only an emoji, I know on PayPal, I can actually text you back, okay, so, um, I text back whenever I get a donation on PayPal, I'll thank you and everything else, but on, um, Cash App, I, I, as far as I know, I don't think that I can type something in there, so I just send back the emojis, because as, as far as I know, that's all that I can do, but, um, if y'all know about that, let me know, and this way I'll actually text you, you know what I mean, because I feel rude, like, how I can't, like, thank you with it, and a spirit tells me not to mention, um, you know, people's names when I get a donation be just out of protection for you guys so this way if there's a cross watcher that's somebody that's you know in your energy um just in case they get upset that you you're you know that you're that you gave me the donation so that's the only reason why and I was um at first I was saying thank you and I'll say the first initial but spirit even told me don't do that because um you know, people get to right away to, you know, doing fucking dumbass, you know, money boxes and everything else. There's also frequencies, guys. There's meditations you can do. It's like the, um, to, to remove, um, money blockage. You literally, I did that. And the next day I got a fucking donation, donation, don it was crazy. Literally the next morning. Um, it's some, it was something called like, uh, money, like a bank, um, it's like money bank um clearing meditation or something like that and literally the next morning i had like i think two or three donations and it was like you know um nice donations too like you know the one donation was the most i've, I've ever had so far um so it really does work guys okay i would suggest somebody sorry yeah so somebody needs to do that somebody needs to do some sort of meditation for the cleansing out you know removing any any blockages okay you can do there's also what is this one i'm gonna show you all this one real quick hold up um where is it at on youtube because this is going to help let me let me pause this and find this real quick so i can help let's see all right sorry guys all right so yeah this one right here this is for um remove let me not get i don't want to get a copyright thing let me just show you i mean i don't think i would because i'm showing you to do it but it's remove all negative blockages programming your mind while you sleep it's affirmations all right and or remove blockages all right and also any creative box like if somebody has that that works and the, the one i was just talking about with the the money the the bank um one where i did it and the next day i actually had like i was like two or three um donations and it was they're nice you know donations too where the fuck is it i just saw it right here this energy it's called hold on energetic bank account um this is on this is also on youtube all right energetic bank account clearing meditation cleanse uh cleanse expand and uplift your abundance potential and it really works i'm telling you i literally i did it and the next morning i had um two or three donations literally but yeah so i don't know how to link it in the in the bio i'm not sure how you do that i'm still like i just opened up this youtube account um why well, i opened it december 31st because i wanted to go into the new year 
um you know what i mean with my youtube already started but i didn't start posting until like january on this account on this so i'm still like new to youtube you know what i mean i'm also f like fairly new to youtube so i'm not really sure exactly how you do everything yet on youtube so um i'm not you know new to this not new to tarot obviously i'm just new to um youtube like you know but so i'm still trying to get the the, the feel of things and how to work everything out so um oh somebody i feel like somebody needs to start a youtube channel that's why that's coming out as well and guys if you're starting a youtube channel you want to you want to also um you know you also want to do download the youtube studio because this is how you get like you know what i mean you you get your analytics and all this shit like this is how you figure everything out like you know you just how you you'll figure everything out I and mean, how you get monetized and everything like that okay but somebody needs to open up a youtube um channel and then this is this is also how you get your comments guys you go right in here in, in the youtube studio and this is where you get all your comments i'm gonna check them again i always check you know i use already you know i always check them i might not be able to reply back to you but i always you know i always hard them at least um if i can because i just get so many comments and stuff and plus i'm always doing readings for you but you know, I always, you know, interact with you guys, always, you know, because I absolutely love and appreciate you, so, but, um, I'm not like the, the karmic ones that, like, don't interact, and then they want you to do everything, but then they don't even have the audacity to respond back to you, I think that's very ignorant, and very rude, but I'm not, not judging anybody, but I'm just saying it's just not, you know what I mean, to get love, you have to give love, you know what I'm saying, so, and, and that's, you know, and I appreciate you. So I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for God. And if it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't have, be able to have any of this if it wasn't for you. So you know what I mean? So, like, I mean, and I appreciate you all so much. So, you know, I, I, inter I interact now with the emails, guys. I get so many emails. It is so hard, like, and um, a lot of people, they'll, they'll be reading. I'll read the whole email, you know what I mean? So, and just with me doing all these readings, plus I have, you know, my daughter, I have my little Clyde baby, and my little kitty cat who's sleeping behind me, and just like daily things that I have to do, you know, and I have to take care of myself and everything. It's just hard to respond back. And please, people, don't get scammed. I'm not doing personal readings at this time. Um, you know, there's a couple reasons why I'm not. And you'll notice a lot of other readers, they stop doing personal readings. It's a protection thing. We have to protect our energy. There's a big reason for it. So please do not get scammed. And, and when I start doing personal readings, um, I'm not going to ever reach out to you first. I'll never do that. So if anybody reaches out to you trying to get you to donate to them, I'll never do that. It, we're trying to get you to pay for readings. It's not me. Please do not get scammed. Please do not get scammed. Please do not get scammed. All right. Somebody might be doing this to you. Um, they have, somebody might have a fake page pretending to be you. I'm strongly getting. It might even be a social media page that they're scamming people on. They're going to get caught up for that. They're going to get up. They're getting caught. Someone's getting caught up for scamming. I just had that scam call coming on my phone, too. Yeah, but guys, please, you know, please remember, um, I doubt that's not me, okay? I will never reach out to you first. Like, if anything, I'll maybe, you know, I'll, I'll reach out to you on the comments and stuff, or I'll tell you to email me. And I have, you know, my email is the same exact thing as my divine messenger 144k no periods no dots no nothing just it's divine messenger 144k and guys i'm going to be expanding i'm going to be opening up another oh wait never mind hold on i was just told not to say that right now never mind yeah so you walked away from these people they're trying to get you to walk away they're trying to manifest you to walk away from